Something doesn't look right. Keep going, boys. Drop back again, Andy. Yeah. Ten all seconds right, to the start right. line. Yeah, they got problems. Ben Angsby's already approaching 30 knots, and Burling and the Kiwis are miles behind. Please start. This could be the makings of the raid. They're, they're, they're dipping. They are going behind right now, and Burling's heading off to make it even a harder dip. Wow. Well, the Kiwis now advancing into the lead. They've somehow clawed back a 450-meter lead that the British had at the outset. Holy mackerel, what a change of events. Frankly, stunning. Made a lot hard for ourselves. You know? Yeah. Ainsley is just going to drop right down and just do a classic match race move right now and use that wing wash to try to slow down the Kiwis. Somebody's got to slow down the Kiwis. British backs right up against the wall. So Ben Ainsley, but well, the British challenge is still alive. They're still here. They are still in the hunt. They've timed it well, the Kiwis. Peter Burling leads them over the start line at around about 25 knots. And Land Rover BAR, the British in behind them, chasing now through the final gates and down the runway to the Challenger playoff final. What a turnaround from two days ago when the boat was upside down. The New Zealanders into the playoff final, and for Britain, the quest is over. Tremendous win for the Kiwis. They can put their feet up for a handful of days at least.